In this video, I'll show you how to permanently ban in subtitles to a video or movie using Subtitle Edit with your preferred font. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are in the world. So, Subtitle Edit is a free application that from version 3.6.2 introduced the option to ban in subtitles to your video. You no longer need to convert your subtitles to ASS uh, styles or subtitles that is advanced substation alpha subtitles but now whether you're working with an srt file you can easily ban in subtitles to a video with your preferred font so let's begin and i already have subtitle edit 3.6.4 downloaded and installed and i'll leave a link below for you to download and install subtitle edit so i'll need to go to video open video file and then open the video file that i want to ban the subtitles to just click on open Secondly, go to file, open and keep video because I already have the subtitles I want to ban to the video. Navigate, look for the subtitle, click on open. Now, this also applies if you are creating subtitles inside Subtitle Edit. You can follow this step, pretty simple. By default, the uh, font that you see here is the preview font. And this font is Tahoma by default. And you can change it uh, via the options, settings, and then click on video player and change to whatever font you want to preview your subtitles in. But when it comes to banning in subtitles with your preferred font, all you need to do is go to video, generate video with banned in subs. And from this interface, then you'll see the different options that you need, the font size, font family, and the other different options that you need. To preview the font that you're using, you need to click on the preview button. I'd prefer if they made this uh, preview button available here and move this section below here so that we can see our preview in real time instead of clicking on the button to see how Vardana font will look like on our subtitles and with an opacity, this is what the Vardana font looks like. If you want to change the font that you want, click on the drop down and choose whatever font you want. I'll press on A to go and select Arial, just click on that. Arial, and then we can just click on preview to see how Arial looks like. This is what the font Arial looks like when we decide to ban in our subtitles using Arial. Let's assume that that looks great on our video. And if we are not going to change any other settings inside here, all we need to do to ban in our subtitles to the video is just click on generate. And once we click on generate, we're going to get the option to save and a file name, and you'll see the extension ban in and with the uh, dimensions and the encoding x264. The save as type is mp4 and click on save. Once I click on save, the subtitles will start to be banned to a video. Click on save and the process begins. It's a pretty short video. It's going to blaze through depending on basically your system and how long the video is. If it was a long movie, it would have probably taken a little bit longer. So it's almost done. Let's wait for it and see if you're going to get the results from the preview. Let's click on open containing folder and let's navigate to the file. This is a file with the band in subtitles. Just double click. I'll just pause, play. With the recent update, there is our video with the subtitles that we selected. That is the font and the opacity. So. That is how you can permanently ban in subtitles to a video or movie using Subtitle Edit with your preferred font. I hope this video will be valuable if you're interested in banning a video or subtitles to a video with your preferred font. Thanks for watching. Until next time, stay safe and never stop learning.